Okay. Hello. Welcome to my shave video. I thought I would do a very quick introduction first, um, just because I think some people <laughs> are a little bit incredulous <laughs> as to why I'm doing this. So I just wanted to say that I'm doing this for two reasons. Um, one, because one of my earliest memories of somebody very close to me, my aunt Kazi, um, was when she was being treated for um, Hodgkin's lymphoma and um, unfortunately she did pass away. Um, she was only 36 years old. I was about seven, seven or eight and she used to have this big wild bushy hair and then suddenly she just didn't have it anymore one day um, but I remember just not feeling any different about it not almost not noticing um, I'm thinking exactly the same loving her exactly the same and um, part of that has made me want to show how I've seen a lot of people very afraid in my job finding out that they're going to lose their hair with chemotherapy treatment and I just wanted to try and help people understand that there are still we still have the capacity to think like children and when we see each other we don't judge each other on what we look like we still have the capacity to see the person inside so even though it's very very scary and it can be quite shocking uh, to lose such a large that people will be able to understand and won't be able to judge you on it and that is something to be trusted another reason is because I've worked with Macmillan nurses before in my career and I think they really need to have a lot of support and deserve absolutely everything um, that anyone can do to fund that service at the moment so that's it <laughs> and uh, okay next bit get the hair off Come here, I'll go at the back. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I, won't, I might wake up tomorrow and yeah. I might be. Do you, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I'm, I might sort of think, oh my god, I've got no air. Yeah. But I think today I'm too excited. Yeah. yeah. But I'll probably no. just after the fact, or when I got yeah. to work on Monday, yeah. <laughs> everyone's going to be expecting it. I think I've got to go there early before anyone gets there. And then they'll have to come and see me. And then I don't have to. You, uh, might, you might just like it though, and I think, ooh, I'll have the air like this all the time. That's what I said. Well, not the bastard. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, some people will be devastated if they have to cut their hair off. Well, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Jimmy wants at the hospital. Oh, you can have some treatment if you want to, but you lose your hair. I thought, oh God, no. That's oh, that's what, what I mean. It scares people so much. Yeah, that's what I thought. The worst thing that could possibly happen to me is to lose my hair. Okay, okay, okay. 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 go wrong can you? Yeah, they said yeah. to me, it's an hairdresser's unit, I go, it's no be and they go, can they do that can they? And I said, well it can't go wrong can it? Yeah. What are you going to do, take too much off? <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Done. 